Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another episode of the Private Property Home Shopper Show. Today we're doing something different. We are in Santon at none other than one of the most exclusive high rises within the CBD and that is Santon Sky. So follow me as we take you through this 9.8 million penthouse apartment. Chad, welcome to my 1501 Santon Sky. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Mike Petro from Remax Advantage and he is going to take me through this apartment so you can see what it's like to tour a 9.8 million penthouse apartment with one of the best, Mike Petro. Mike, take it away. Thank you, Chad. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm very pleased to take you through this. What we have here is a three bedroom, three bathroom, 150 square meter penthouse apartment with the most insane sunset views, which I can't wait to take to you. But I think uh, the best way to start off is right here on my right. We have the self-contained studio apartment, which is actually the first bedroom over here. Do you want to join me, Chad? 100%. So this is completely sealed off from the rest of the apartment. Exactly. So you'll see as I take you there in a second, the rest of the penthouse is actually separated by these doors. And you have this unit over here, which has actually got its own climate control, own bathroom, everything like that. It's also got space over here for these, uh, you can put a bar fridge here at the bottom. They've got these oven tops here and a microwave. Genuinely, if the in-laws are coming or anything like that, you can just keep them this side. They don't have to go into your space of the penthouse. Uh, but yeah, it's a beautiful space over here. Stunning view. I mean, you've got the view of the whole of downtown Bryanston. Most of Santon, this in, at night must look incredible and what I love, and you've, you've been polite and you haven't mentioned it, is guys, take a look at this bathroom, completely glass, sealed off, and I love that you said that the climate control is separate from... From the, the rest of it, yeah. I think that's so awesome, beautiful carpets, love the countertops, smeg appliances, you know you're living luxury. All the way smeg appliances. All let's the way take, through. Let's take a look at this, come on, I love this. Yeah, so if maybe I can just speak a little bit more into the space over here. Uh, so the first thing I want to say is this, you know, you have these uh, floating vanity over here, which is well, exactly what you need for a high end uh, apartment and this beautiful splash back they've got over here. But what's quite awesome is there's no frame on this mirror and it's kind of pushed out of it. So it gives off that floating effect, uh, which is not something that you often get in a place like this. And then obviously we have an ensuite shower and a toilet frosted glass all the way through so it's not like it's too unprivate or something like that but yeah this is a proper high-end bathroom it's what you would expect in a in a place like this so we've wrapped up mostly about this apartment but some other really cool features is the storage here within your own kitchenette you've got a desk here to do some work so if your in-laws are here if some friends are staying over or even if you want to rent this out as your own enclosed apartment you've got places there to work and take care of it and then obviously we need to talk about the cupboard space and there are two cupboards built in here with this beautiful gloss lacquer it really does feel upmarket and i love that and again guys you know i love solid doors and they are here and pretty tall ones how tall are these two meters so yeah, these are about two meters and you'll see, and we'll emphasize a little bit more in the main space, they've actually got some recessed lighting as well. Adds about a half a meter extra as well. Really adds the volume of the space, which is something quite impressive. Come on, private property, we're moving in, eh? We're moving in, come guys, I want this to be on your wish list. And come on through here, like the kings and queens you are, we've got these double doors opening out onto the main space. And Mike, take it away. Tell me about this main space. It looks incredible. Yeah, so first on these doors, these are actually what separated us from that studio space as well. As I say, if you have guests staying over, you can keep them there. They don't even have to enter your space at all, which is quite lovely. So as we walk through here, the first thing 
Uh, to my right over here, probably your left as you come through, is we have a guest bathroom. Uh, we have once again a floating mirror, floating vanity. Uh, we have a hidden toilet system and a beautiful splashback once again. And then from here we flow seamlessly out into this beautiful uh, living room with an open plan arrangement. And the first thing you walk into, as Chad has just done, is the kitchen. I mean, this kitchen is nice and I love the way this countertop, but it's not a marble countertop. What kind of top is this? The way it sparkles is Yeah, so this is called a black galaxy quartz and you'll see specifically as the sun sets in front of us and you might even be getting it on the camera now, but you'll see these sparkles of blues and greens and reds that come through. It's quite original and I actually have not seen a penthouse in Sanson with this type of finish, so it's pretty unique. It does look as special as one would think specifically for an apartment of this like it gives you a feeling that you know, it really knows or it really tells you that you've arrived and to set that in stone, you've got Smeg Electric, Smeg Extractor, Smeg Stove. I mean, what else is in the Smeg kitchen all that we need the to way talk through. about? And I think to emphasize that a little bit more, if you take a look at our basin, even the basin is Smeg. It's a Smeg so basin. all the way through high-end appliances, uh, and that's what you get when you buy 9.8 million penthouse apartments. Behind you over here, as you can see, we have a separate scullery. Uh, yeah, so that's essentially for dishes and that. You don't want necessarily to show that stuff when you are, are hosting and that, so you can simply just close it off as Chad has so gracefully done over there. So you've got your one sink there. Generally what we speak about is the chef sink. Then you've got another sink here, so at least if you are washing up, you can throw everything over there. All your appliances, under counter. You've got those beautiful gloss counters here as well as over counter storage. So, I mean, for an apartment that is by no means massive, that's such good utilization of space that it doesn't feel small, it doesn't feel cramped. It really does feel like a perfectly set out apartment. I love what has been done. And let's talk about the dining area. I mean, we've got to come here. Yeah, no, you have to. And this speaks a little bit more into that open arrangement that you get. We were just there in the kitchen and it's, it's built for hosting. You can be chatting to the chef, whoever's preparing the food, and then it flows seamlessly into our dining room. And I do want to talk a little bit more about this actual table here. They've gone with a round table, which is quite an interesting choice. And as you take a look at these beams here, it seems that everything's balancing on each other. I mean, this is a high-end furniture that they've included. And I think what's Does important the furniture about come with that, it? that's exactly it. This is going at 9.8 fully furnished. So everything you see here, that comes with it. And it is a great choice because this is an eight-seater dining room table that again fits in really comfortably and very rarely are people having eight people you know, at, your, at your dining room table. Then you've got stunning downlighting and one of my favorite features, I'll be honest, we're going into summer, you've got the aircon just above your head and this nice bulkhead ceiling. The bulkheads are interesting because this one comes down and then right over there we've got almost recessed LED lighting and the way it flows again does make this place feel very special. Exactly, exactly. And to talk a little bit more into that, this is the money shot right here, to my left. This type of view and this hosting arrangement, that is to me what really makes the apartment. And as you come out and experience this type of view, where you have 180 degree views, you just feel a lot larger than life. And that's what this recessed ceiling does, is it brings out that larger volume feel. Does it look like I'm making the millions now? It does. Just it really, sitting really down does. here, what a view. I actually cannot get over this view. This is incredible at night. And we're gonna have some sunset shots intermixed while we are talking. So take a look at what sunset looks like right here in the heart of Sands and you can walk to wherever you wanna go if you wanna do that. Nice space here. I like how they've built in this wall unit housing your TV and the TV is on a bracket so you can still bring it out and position it more centrally to the couches exactly. if you like, but it's not in the way and it's not interrupting this because this is stunning. But there's more. So tell me about it. As I say, so that's the whole thing is you don't want the TV to be the star of the show, which is why it's just pushed out to the side a little bit. Uh, but what's really cool is we're going to open out now onto what is the office of a CEO, no doubt about it. Let's take a walk through. Yeah, so then we flow out once again into what is the office of a, of a CEO. You can just tell that this is where the work gets done. I'm writing it on my visualizer board. You know, you've got to, you've got to visualize to achieve or you've got to believe to achieve. And I love these stackable doors here and I, these tiles, I've never seen such nice tiles, have to be marble. It is marble. Uh, it's, it's a natural stone tile as you can see, but it's like a royal Persian finish running all the way through. Uh, and it's also got this awesome gloss reflect reflection to it, which reflects the sky as you look down into it. It just really adds, once again, it, it makes you think that you're in the clouds. Generally you're eating on marble, but yeah, in the center sky, you're walking mm -hmm. on marble. Exactly. 
And then, yeah, as you can see, just to my left over here, there is also a, a bathroom over here. This can technically be called the third bedroom. Uh, and so this would be an ensuite, but you know, sometimes work does get a bit intense. You need to go for a shower afterwards. And that's why this is just, this is just the perfect uh, arrangement. So you've got your floating toilet, hidden cistern, floating vanity, beautiful mirror, and then a walk-in glass frame shower. So you're coming right out the shower, sitting down here, Hey, everybody's working from home. You're gonna be going into your meetings. And then behind you, another one of those incredible views. Exactly. And there's not a lot to complain about, eh? There's, not, there's nothing to complain about, really. <laughs> so we've spoken about this. We've spoken about the fully enclosed guest suite. It's not even a, it's not even a house, it's like a little suite. It's exactly. beautiful. Which leaves the creme de la creme. The master suite. The master suite, exactly, on its own wing of the property. I think we need to go check it out. I do. Let's go. Let's go. Mm, I could see myself living here, Mike. Yeah, believe me. Are you taking heavily discounted offers? Uh, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> from me, from private property. And here we are. Oh man, this is incredible. Where do you want to start? Ah, uh, well, I think a good way to show is to just walk into this bathroom for a second. And as you'll be able to see, I'm pretty sure the viewers can still see us. Would you look at this? And I think that has a lot to do with this open bathroom design that they've got going over here. Man, this is So somebody can pass you your pina coladas while you're having a nice bath. Nice bubble bath, light a few candles. I mean, you're in a penthouse after all. You know why the window's here, hey? You know why people have installed the window here. This is incredible. <laughs> we do know. We I do know. love this. And then, oh, shower as well. Yeah, shower over here. Once again, beautiful splashback running through over there where the piping is. Uh, frosted glass once again, which slides in and out like this. And behind me, which I'm sure you've noticed, is this beautiful double vanity that they've got going once again with this floating mirror design. Huge mirror as well. Exactly, exactly. I mean, this is this needs to fit two people and you know, sometimes you just need to take a look. You're and Exactly, exactly. And then over here behind this frosted glass, that's your, yeah, that's your that toilet. Is your, that is your toilet going through, which I will show you. So, what, so what you're telling me is if we close this, right, um, you can either see beautifully into the bathtub or you can see beautifully into whoever's having a shower. No, I mean sometimes you just have nothing to hide. This is just <laughs> right for me. <laughs> and then after that, yeah, we're flowing out uh, into the master bedroom. Stunning here. cupboards. Exactly. So plenty of storage space, floor, floor to ceiling cupboards going through. Uh, you can see there's obviously this TV space behind you. Uh, and what's quite nice, you can fit a desk in there if you wanted to. They've opted to leave that uh, open like that. Uh, but yeah, I mean, once again, if you have a penthouse, there's no need to, to go to the TV room to watch TV. I mean, you can have your TV. And watch it right here. Aircon again, bulkhead ceilings. I love how much space is in this master suite because right over here, you can sit down, enjoy reading. You've got nearly floor to ceiling glass windows here. Now the glass, double paint. Yes. So, you know, cool in, winter, uh, cool in summer, warm in winter, saving you the electricity bill. Although if you're buying this apartment, you're probably not worried about your electricity. <laughs> but still, it's nice to know that your house is going to remain warm. And I mean, it's pretty nice and cool yeah. and we're going into quite a hot day. No, exactly. Bear in mind, the sun has also been setting on this unit, is... so we have had sunshine going through. Uh, but yeah, no, it's a very, it's a cozy living arrangement. It's, it's very comfortable. And I think the carpets in the bedroom, a lot of people don't necessarily like that, but it really works for this space. And I love the nice touch that the carpets flow into the tiles of the bathroom, but the tiles of the bathroom are set or different between your shower and your actual bathroom. So they've actually even thought of that and put in different tiles, which is quite nice. Exactly. And that view is incredible. Guys, that view is incredible. But that is, well, it's concluded it. But before we go and say goodbye, tell me some other things about this building. So Santon Sky, heart of Santon. Yes, what we're actually, what's nice is this a little bit more to the west side of Santon. So you do get the morning side address as well, which is quite lovely. In terms of the location of, I must say, this penthouse in particular, as you see these fantastic sunsets, um, it's kind of unobstructed in front of you, which is more than you can say for a lot of the other skyscrapers. But the building itself uh, is something quite special. So a little bit more into the amenities of that. Uh, you can see that there's this beautiful gym uh, that they've gotten installed there for the residents. There is also a swimming pool for the space as well. Beautiful lobby area. I'm sure you saw as you walked through. Uh, and then, yeah, some lovely restaurant spaces below. as 24-hour well. security, underground parking, boomed off, security guard at the front, which is always great. Exactly. Although I doubt anybody in Santa ever worries about security, but it's nice to know that when those summer hailstorms come, you got underground parking. Exactly. What a nice place to be. So I think you need to come with me 
and we're gonna have to say goodbye to you guys you guys have been fantastic as usual we hope you've enjoyed seeing this apartment so let's go find out where we want to say goodbye to you and talk more about purchasing this home i'll see you and ladies and gentlemen thank you so much for this journey it's been incredible to tour this and with somebody i think it's been quite interesting doing this with you and i've really enjoyed it no it's been a great dynamic i think i think we need to do it again so i guys, think so in the comments let me know if you'd like to see me and mike go at it again with a different apartment or a house somewhere here in santon or maybe even in an area that you live but from myself chad i do need to say goodbye but before i do that i want to pass it over to mike because if you want to buy this house or if you need some estate agency advice, Mike's gonna take you through a couple of things and introduce himself and his brand. So Mike, take it away. Perfect, thanks. Yeah, so for those of you who now know me, I'm Mike Petro. I'm a sales associate for Remax Advantage. And genuinely, if you're looking for a luxury high-end property, whether it's buying or selling, I'm the guy for you. As you can see, we're doing this type of marketing. We're doing having a bit of fun with these properties. I clearly like what I do. And that's the type of energy that I think we need to bring into this type of industry. Absolutely. And if they want to buy this house? Perfect. So you can contact Remax Advantage at any time. Uh, my details are also linked below here. I feel feel free to call me at any time. I also got emails on that. And if you go to the Remax Advantage page, you can see my details there as well. It's a good way to contact me about it. Remax Advantage is the place to be whether you're buying, you're selling. They are such an incredible estate agency. Thank you so much for taking some time out to do this with me. I do Thank appreciate you. it. All the best. So his details are on screen and then as well in the description of the video. But for myself, Chad, from Mike, from the team at Private Property, from the team at The Home Shopper Show, thank you so much. And remember, guys, whether you're looking to buy a home this expensive or if you're looking for something in between, visit www.privateproperty.co.za and you can browse all of the estate agents' listings in your area in one quick and convenient site. So guys, don't hesitate to look around there. Thank you so much. We love you and we'll see you next time. Goodbye. Cheers.